In this video, I'll show you how to configure recall for uh, Android. Okay, first you have to install the license key for recall. Go to uh, setup, licensed features, and feature keys. Okay, and you will uh, have the list of uh, on the screen the list of all installed licenses. And to add the new license, you have to push this add button page and add new extension okay i am adding this extension 90. and here i have to add the display name of of that extension okay i have uh, entered demo equal display name and uh, after saving it okay I am getting ready extension I don't need to change anything here sorry I forgot to assign IP line okay to this extension let me assign IP line number two and push save button once more okay now I have extension which is ready for configuring with the call. Okay. Now I go to interfaces and uh, clicking on IP line number two because it was connected to my extension number 90. Okay. Currently that line is disabled, inactive. I am clicking here and selecting EPG equal from the list. Okay, and then what I have to do here, actually nothing. And pushing save button, okay now you will see this qr code it appeared on the screen so now i am ready to configure a call on android now let's see how to configure it uh, on android phone okay when you are installing and opening uh, that application first time if there are no accounts, then it is opening this page. Okay, and you have to add account. To do that, you have to click this button, this icon, and then scan the QR code. I'm scanning that immediately from, from the screen. The account added last becomes the default account. You can see uh, the account name on the top of the uh, equal window. The account indicator changes the color to green as soon as the account uh, registers. If it cannot register, it stays yellow for a while and then gets red. You can configure up to eight accounts on one or many uh, QX or UC devices. You can add new account anytime tapping this menu button and the the account okay selecting the account from the menu okay let me add the second account okay now i am scanning the second account okay and you see it's added here as default account. I have to wait until it uh, registers. You see it's yellow now. Okay, it's, it's green now. Now, if uh, you want to change the default account, which is used for making outbound calls, then you have to go here and Select another account. You see? 
Now my default account is the demo e call. To configure multi functional programmable keys, you have to go to interfaces, okay? Then uh, click on the MPKs of MPK of IP line which you are using on iCall. I'm clicking here and you see I have already configured some MPKs here. When you finished configuration you push the save button and uh, the configuration will be automatically sent to eCall on your Android. That's it. You have configured your account and you can use it now. Thank you.